What is up guys, Vulcan here, and in today's video I will be going over this Three Musketeers deck. So the way I came about this deck was I was trying to figure out what was the best uh, Three Musketeers deck that also had Ghost in it. So I tried it with um, Guards instead of Electro Wizard and Minions instead of Ice Spirit. And then I was just testing different versions. Um, I failed a couple of grand challenges because I couldn't find the right version. I tried Fire Spirits and then Electro Wizard. And then I decided I'd put in P.E.K.K.A. in this deck because I was losing to um, Mega Knight. And so I put in P.E.K.K.A. and it's been seeming to do pretty well. So I'm currently 9-0 in a Grand Challenge and we'll see if I can finish this thing off. So the basic idea behind this deck is really, it's, it's pretty much the same as any 3 Musty Cheers deck. Um, the P.E.K.K.A. doesn't change it all that much. The game plan is just to pump up and then uh, split three musketeers in defense or split three musketeers uh, in double elixir. So the world of ghosts is a really good card in my opinion. I would I would never say that like it's a bad starting move to start with world of ghosts, which is one of the reasons it makes it so good. Uh, you can pretty much always get value out of it, but I don't think it's I don't know, I don't I don't think it's like overpowered to the point where you can't counter it, but you definitely need some uh, defense for it. So I just play my P.E.K.K.A. there because uh, I have to get that Royal Ghost out of the way, and um, my P.E.K.K.A. is pretty much the best counter in my deck to Royal Ghost. So I'm just going to pump up here. He might poison that pump. Yes, he does. It's all good. Uh, I can just split my three musketeers now. After I defend this Inferno Dragon. I don't know. Some of these Bridge Freedom decks have uh, Mega Knight in them, but I'm going to hope he doesn't. If he doesn't Mega Knight, it's going to be a little bit bad for me, but it should be fine. So I'm actually going to minor this because the Royal Ghost does a really good job at uh, killing the musketeers. And I think I might even send a Royal Ghost out. Ooh, well played by him. I'll play Electro Wizard just to make sure that it doesn't connect to my tower. And I'll have a nice counter push. So, I'm just gonna wait to get full on Elixir. I'm not gonna rush the pump. Um, yeah, now I'll pump up. Hopefully he supports this... Uh, Ghost, so I can get some nice poison value. He does not, so I'll just have to use Ice Spirit here, and then I'll go with um, three Musketeers. Okay, so nice. Oh, unfortunately, that connects. On it, I don't know how it connects. I'm kind of surprised. Dang. Bridge Beam is definitely a hard matchup for this deck, but I think I can win this. Okay, I'm going to split my three Musketeers here. I think they can kill that um, Inferno Dragon before it even has a chance to kill my P.E.K.K.A. maybe. No, it does not, but it's fine. And now I will attack and try to finish off this game. I Even though he has poison, I could split my three Musketeers there because the poison takes like eight seconds to kill the three Musketeers. So, they could get defensive value before they even died. So, GG. Got that game in the bag. Um, Bridge Fan is definitely a hard matchup, but you just have to be careful and try not to pump up when they have, like, their big push in hand. Uh, use your P.E.K.K.A. to defend it, get some value, and then go for the pump. Okay, so we are up against ZS Niche. I have pump in my starting hand, so I'll just wait a second or two. This is a bit of a more expensive 3 must tier stack, so... Just wait a second to see if he does anything. If not, I'm just going to pump up. Okay. Waiting for his move. See what he does. Um, just play Electro Wizard. Interesting. I think I'm going to have to play a defensive miner here. Not much of a choice. I'm just going to have to zap because... Um, 
He definitely would have got through my defense if I had not used that zap. Nice. He poisoned. I could go three months of tears, but I'm all the way back to another pump, and I probably have, have an elixir vanish at this point, so I'm just going to pump up. And I can do the exact same defense I just did. I'm going to pump up in the corner because he doesn't have minor. So I can get some nice uh, value on that. Okay, he's going to go with uh, spamming at the bridge again. This time I'll be able to use a defensive Royal Ghost, which is really good. Okay. Nice. And then I'm going to counter push with a Miner. Ooh, he has a P.E.K.K.A. <clears throat> okay, so now I'm going to use my three Musketeers on defense and hopefully try to DPS down this P.E.K.K.A. before um, the Poison can kill the three Musketeers. Nice. He does a smart move and does not poison him, but it still should uh, kill his push. Not sure if I need that Electro Wizard, but I'm just playing it safe because I don't want to get too much damage on my tower. And it should end up working out. Okay. I play a Royal Ghost on defense here, and I think the, the Ice Spears goes down in time. Should be able to stop this. I'm going to have to play a P.E.K.K.A. Otherwise... Oh, it connected anyway. Wow. But now I can now I can pump up, and if he poisons this pump, I'll be able to play through Musketeers. I don't think he has Inferno Dragon, which is really good. It makes this matchup a lot easier. Okay, I think I'm going to split two Musketeers in one lane, and then I'll have my Electro Wizard and Musketeer in the other lane. Ooh, smart move by him. Okay, he's definitely playing this match well, but uh, I think I can still come back and win it. I'll have to sacrifice some tower on my uh, some damage on my other tower because, well, just because I should. Okay, he's probably gonna support the Pekka. He's probably gonna throw a Pekka, so I'm gonna throw that in the opposite lane. I think I need to play a defensive minor here. Yeah. Ooh, I tried to place a Pekka, but it didn't place. There we go. I'll be able to get out another pump, and then we should have a really nice elixir advantage on him now. I'll be able to split my three muscle cheers again. And maybe even win this game. Okay, so he's he's going to try to go all in right now. So hopefully he might even ignore my three muscle cheers. He does not. Well played. Okay, I'm just gonna go for another pump. He just spent his poison. Uh oh. A bit of a bad pump on my part. But we should have a really good elixir advantage now. Okay, I'm gonna split my three muscle cheers again. I think I'm gonna have to cycle back to a P.E.K.K.A. for this defense. Nice. He's definitely playing this really well. Um, okay, now it's kind of now or never. I'm going to have to go in for this push and hopefully get the victory. So I'll split two Musketeers this way, and he'll probably P.E.K.K.A. that, to be honest. Yes, he does. So I'm going to throw a P.E.K.K.A. out in front myself. I think I have to defense a Miner here, unfortunately. Uh, I'll have to use... Electro Wizard on defense, and I think I might have this win. Do I? Oh, good game. Yeah, that was a very close matchup, and definitely the trick there was getting a giant pump advantage. You can pump in over... Like, don't be afraid to pump in overtime if they're not going to get down your tower. Make sure to get that pump out. So, I'm 11-0. Let's see if we can get that nice 12 win. It took me a couple tries to warm up with this, so don't expect to like get 12 win on your first try unless you're just really good at three muscle tears. Um, but just if you do lose, just look back at your replay and say, what could I have done better? That's what I did, and um, now I seem to be playing it pretty well. Okay, so I don't have a minor hand, so I can't really punish that pump, so I'm just going to play Ice Tear in the back. You might be a three muscle tier deck also. I think I'll play Royal Ghost in the back. And... I'll just play minor. It'll get countered by those three muscle tears, but it's fine. 
He plays three messages first, which is really good for me. You always want to be the second person to play them. Unfortunately, though, I don't really have a mini tank to kill those three musketeers, so... I'm just gonna electro wizard them, honestly. Just to keep my three musketeers alive longer. Just threw an ice root there to get down that roller ghost. We're looking nice. Uh oh. Honestly, I have no choice but to play a P.E.K.K.A. here, and I'll zap that minion horde. I think that should be able to defend it uh, pretty well. But, not the best situation. A pretty even Elixir trade, though, I think. I'll just keep in mind now to save my Electro Wizard for that minion horde. Okay, so I'm going to go with the Royal Ghost and then a Miner on the pump to kill it. He might split three Musketeers here again, but if he does... Ooh, nice. Okay, so I played him in three Musketeers here because I could get a lot of defensive value. And if I played my P.E.K.K.A., then his uh, three Musketeers would have been able to... Uh, kill my P.E.K.K.A. because I don't have a big spell, so it kind of would have been a waste. And now I can use uh, P.E.K.K.A. on defense to kill these Musketeers if he decides to support them. If not, I'll just play an Electro Wizard. Okay, so I need to get my double zap down. Ooh. Not the best situation. Hopefully I can get this down. Hopefully. Oh, no. But now is the point where... um. Oh, I was going to say, I was going to play all my three musketeers in one lane, but... Okay. I'm going to go with P.E.K.K.A. and just try to finish off this game. I kind of had to ignore that minion horde. It's kind of now or never at this point. Okay, good game. Well played. Nice, I got that troll though. I'm not going to lie, I failed like... Well, I failed three grand challenges I failed four grand challenges before this um I tried a couple different versions and I found out that this is definitely my favorite version that has ghosts in it if you want a version without ghosts in it I would say just play the standard three musty tier deck with minion horde um goblin gang and battle ram and uh ice golem that's probably that version is still very viable and um yeah but I think if you want to have a Royal Ghost in there, a P.E.K.K.A. is definitely very good just because otherwise Mega Knight will get a ton of value and it won't work out too well for you. Ooh, nice. We got that Electro Wizard. One away from level four, which will be really nice. And yeah, one other thing I should mention is that yesterday I streamed and the stream, I would say the stream was going kind of well, but the only problem was that it was lagging a lot, so I couldn't um, I couldn't play my games like without getting lag. So I kept losing just because I was lagging, and it was um, I don't know, it was a bit unfortunate. Uh, I bought a new computer so that that wouldn't happen, and it still uh, was lagging anyway. So I'm going. Some people have been messaging me. Uh, really thankful for that, and I'm going to read their messages and test out all the stuff that they've been. Uh, giving me advice to do and yeah hopefully i can get a stream coming up soon and yeah thank you guys so much for watching Vulcan out